Hello everybody, Santa Claus here in Aurora Dingland back again. I'm actually surprised I can do three videos in one day with this Wi-Fi situation. Hopefully it'll get better as soon as we get the new one. But uh, we had a lot, lot going on today. Uh, our tricycle here looks brand new. The guys worked on it all day. Changed the oil, cleaned it all up. All this black was painted today. I mean, it looks fantastic. Looks like a brand new trike. We oiled the chain. Uh, did all kinds of maintenance because it was a little shaky on the suspension. They really did a nice job just with spray cans and paint. That's all it takes. And then they cleaned it up really good, gave it a nice bath, beautiful job. And then the coconut guy, he's not quite finished, he did uh, I think 32 trees today, something like that, 35 trees, he's going to do the rest tomorrow, so we paid him for the work done. Uh, all the material for the solar lights got delivered today. Uh, that was expensive. All the material together, just uh, the poles and stuff we need to put the lights up were uh, like 17,000 pesos, over $300. <clears throat> That's not counting the lights. That's not counting the labor. Uh, but the big job was here on the beach. As you can see in the past video, the loader, bulldozer, I call it a bulldozer, they call it a loader. He was here for hours and hours. And he did even a better job than I totally expected. I did not expect him to do what you're seeing now. This big mound. He put this to protect our beach for storm surges and high tide. Um, it's, it won't stay like that the first couple storms. Hey, don't play on that. Uh, it'll probably be, uh, a lot lower once we get some storms in here. But, uh, take a look at the sand. It's a lot better. Most of the big rocks are gone. Of course, there's going to be a few left, but we can even do those by hand. But the big job was that he rerouted the water. Wait till you see this. Now the kids are playing on the mounds of dirt. I told them to stay off ours. But he re redid the flow so it's done properly. So it's flowing straight out not making the right turn anymore. Sorry if you have wind noise. But I just want to show you what he did. Look at this. So we totally have a barrier now, but like I said, it probably won't stay this way. First couple storms. Sorry about the wind noise, I know you're getting it. But I just wanted to show you. So I'll head back. Hope we actually have some beach now. I'll probably rake a lot of this by hand to get it even better. That's what I did last year. I got a uh, nice hand rake and I got all the other stones and I made it real nice. So it's a hell of a job. I didn't think, like I said, I didn't think he would do this much work. Now we got to stop the kids from playing on the mounds. That'll be a job. As you can see, already kids are on it. 
But uh, it'll get knocked down either by kids or by the weather. But for now, it's a nice barrier. Um, actually, I don't care if it gets knocked down because uh, it kind of takes away from my view a little bit. That's why I don't want to build a big wall. I don't know if you're allowed to anyway. But everybody keeps saying, oh, why don't you guys build like a wall like this, Gabion wall. No, I don't want one. One, it's too expensive. Two, it takes away your view. Nature's going to do what nature's going to do. So that's it, everybody. That catches you up. Uh, the bulldozer guy charged me 15,000 pesos. That's uh, about 300 bucks, which is a total bargain for all the work and hours he did. I like to give you guys prices because uh, I don't like when uh, other people put things on YouTube. Houses and motorcycles and this and that. Show it to you how beautiful it is and then don't give you any price. You know, I want to know how much things cost. I think everybody else does too. So you guys who do that should really... Uh, Really put the prices in there. People want to know. I'm not afraid to tell people how much things cost. It's not a big secret. Anyway, thanks thanks again for watching, people. Make sure you like and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed these uh, videos. We'll see what happens tomorrow. I know more tree trimming for sure. What else I don't know. Uh, and then we'll do another weekend at Adams, I'm sure. So thanks again, once again. I appreciate it. God bless everyone. Santa Claus. Now living in the Philippines and ding -a Over and out. Here comes James. One last time. Hi! Take care, people.